Oh, hey, Jeff. So hey. I was just uh, telling OG we got some fan mail. Pretty Ooh. cool, right? Yeah, I mean, we've been getting YouTube hits left and right. And uh, now, oh, let me pull this one. Oh, okay, here's a good one. I think OG's going to like this. He's probably thinking, oh, shit, <laughs> not again. Yeah. So, um, <laughs> all right. Gregory W. writes, Dear Iwama Warriors, I would really like if you guys could read this on an episode of Iwama Warriors. Well, Gregory W., that's exactly what we're going to do for you. So, Gregory W. writes, Iwama Warriors, would you please show a one-two punch combination in one episode of Iwama Warriors? Well, Gregory W., it's your lucky day. That's exactly what we're going to do is a one-two punch combination for you here on the Iwama Warriors. Oh, gee, how do you feel about that? <laughs> well, Gregory W., what the fans ask for, the fans get, OG. I know. <laughs> All right, so, Gregory W., we're going to demonstrate a one-two punch combination. Now, you can look at it a couple different ways. All right, so OG can lead with that front hand. He can punch, then come in with the back hand, and we can go into a Kuragayesh, or OG's favorite, a Yubi Dori. He's got a little sunburn, so I'm going to stay away from his shoulders. So we'll get that Yubi Dori. Right. Another way we can look at this one is if, say, he punches with that backhand and then the front hand. We can come into a Kurugai S. We want to be nice, we can take him out, or we can go straight down. A nice little pin right here. And he's tapping with his feet. That's how you know you got a good one. How's that sunburn, OG? Next time, use SPF 100. Thanks again for checking us out here on the Iwama Warriors. Don't forget, check us out every Monday and Friday for new episodes. Drop us a comment if you guys want to see something, you like what you see, you want to hate, you want to hate. Sure, bring it. I don't care. Because if you hate enough, you might get a little bit of attention. Like one of our recent trolls. <laughs> Guy got 17 views in two years, no subscribers, and he's an expert in Aikido. Thumbs up to you, buddy. Keep on trolling, we'll keep rolling. All right, so, um, if you guys have seen some of the stuff Lenny's been doing, they do a lot of hand deflections in Tenshin. We don't do a whole lot of that here uh, with Iwama style, but we wanna show some more of the practical stuff. And we actually got a request for this uh, from a couple different people. We had a guy from Sweden uh, saying, hey, you know, what about a one-two combination? I was like, all right, cool, we can look at that. Um, we had another guy, I believe his name is William. Uh, he had asked for a one-two combination, so this is for you guys. Uh, if you guys want to see something else, let us know. And um, this is just our take on it. All right? With me, OG. Hi, Shamas. All right. So we'll do a um, instead of doing like left, right, left, we'll do like a one-two combination. So he comes in. Uh, I got my right foot forward, and he punches with his front hand. So it's a one, two. All right, I cut that down, I grab, and I come in with a back fist here. So again, it was a one, two, getting off that line, brings around, come in with a back fist, gaining control here. Now slide back that way. So again, front hand, so you got a one, two, grabbing, and come in over here with a back hand, or your back fist to the neck, right? Or the jaw. Again, same thing. So it's a one, two, here, right? You strike somebody hard enough on the side of the neck on the crowd or you knock them out. Might even get their job, right? Uh, you, you use your forearm as well. Right, one more time. Right, so let's say one, two, grabbing that, getting out of that way, right? You can get the forearm right on the side of the neck, back fist, back knuckle, you know, aim for the soft, hard to soft, right? So again, so let's say one, two, and a strike. Again. So, one, two. 
So he's not, don't think it's magic that he's falling into me. So slow down, I can say, one, two, I have his momentum and control and I'm pulling him. All right, as I go with my hand here and I transition this down, his body comes forward, try to just, right? He still wants to come forward. You're in the middle of a punch, you're not gonna, you know, as he comes with that back hand, he's not gonna stop. You know, magically, like put the brakes on, huh, gotta pump them, right? So, front hand is gonna go with one, two, getting out of that way. Or even if he wants to come in with that second punch or a third punch, straight in, right? Back fist there, and then I can take us into a throw. Three, wherever I wanna go, right? <laughs> I have an Ikkyo, it's right there as well. If you can't throw him, you got an Ikkyo. <coughs> didn't wanna break your mirror. <laughs> I didn't wanna break your face. <laughs> <laughs> so he comes in uh, one more time. So, so one, two, back fist. You can take that into a throw. You can bring him around, around, and around, and go. Hey! Right, you have him. Grab by, grab the bull by the horns, and have a ride. Right? You attacked me. Hey, hang on, buddy. Right? Slide back a little bit. Right? Uh, the combination is a little, a little bit quicker. So say one, two. Come in with a back fist. All right, a little disconnected. So it's on me. So, you know, one, two. You're eating him. Hey, he came in faster. Back of the next right there. You ever get hit on the back of the next, it will knock you out. <coughs> Another one we have. <coughs> excuse me. So, um, front hand deflection again. He comes in. One, two. Right, getting off that line. Go straight into a kaitanage from here. So, one, two, grabbing underneath. All right, I, if I don't get that grab, I can do a deflection as well. So, one, two, cut, go straight into Kaitanage. One more time. So, front hand, one, two, cutting it. All right, take it right into Kaitan. You can take it into a pin. All right, straight into the Kaitanage pin. Uh, you can take it into a throw as well. One more time, slow down. So it's that same one, two, instead of coming in with a strike, complete that tank on. Say I hook his arm right here, I can drop it straight down. Nice little chicken wing pin right there. <clears throat> Another one. So as he uh, skis with that, or punches, jabs with that front hand, so you know, one, two, Cutting that in, you can go into an Arimi Nage as well. So you have one, two, and you have an Arimi Nage. Uh, you can do a different deflection with that. You can go one, two, and into an Arimi Nage. So you can go from your backhand, you jab one, two, this one comes out for Arimi Nage. So don't get hung up on which hand. Um, you don't get punched. You don't get taken to the ground, you don't get kicked, it's a good damn day. All right, so I'm not gonna get hung up on that, so he comes in one, two, getting out of the way, coming for an arena nugget. So backhand comes up, deflects, one, two, and he's right in line with me, drop, and you know, um, It's just one way to do an arena nugget. There's thousands upon thousands of ways to do them. But uh, back to that one again. So he comes in, set one, two, grab, bring me down here. One more time. Okay. So let's see. Oh, one, two. One, two. Hey! Drop straight down. You can step back. Uh, the momentum's already going backwards, so tank on, you know. Or, you know, take a step back, and keep turning, and drop, okay, down. <clears throat> Another. Way to look at this is say he uh, he comes in with that backhand, he reaches, he doesn't step through, but he skis. One, right? That other hand comes through, two, right? And you can throw here, or you can come in with another Narimi Nagi variation. <clears throat> so he comes with that back one, one, that other hand's there, two. You have two options, you can grab the arm and throw, right? Or you can step across into a variation. Uh, we did something similar to that not that long ago. 
I think we did it from a kata dori, right? right. <clears throat> so from the kata dori standpoint, you know, it's almost that same thing. Stepping in, come through, and then throw over the hip, and then drop them in your pin. You got that elbow, you smash that elbow right there. So again, a trained fighter's not gonna come up to you on the street and be like, hey, you're a black belt. You're first degree, second degree, third degree, right? It, nobody does that. They're not, trained fighters don't really have that mentality. I mean, if they do, they do, but it's not likely somebody's gonna come up, hey, I'm an MMA cage fighter. You practice Aikido, hey, let's go round for round. Come on, guys. This is real world, not make-believe land. All right, so again, uh, so the backhand comes in. So this is, he's reaching, he's not stepping through, reaching as a one, that second hand comes through, two, right? You can go for a throw right here. Take him straight there. Uh, you can do a low fall. You know, you don't have to take a high fall for this. So again, that backhand goes one, two, right? You can go in for an arimi nagi this way. So you're stepping in, cradling, and you that arimi nagi. Uh, you can do the throw, you know, whatever you find here. So you can go, oh, uh, sorry, you go one, yep, two, you can throw, three. Press on that elbow, right? Where you can get that arimi nagi variation. So he comes in with that backhand, not stepping through. Somebody might step through, they might not step through. Uh, it's just gonna change up a little bit. So he comes in, getting out of the way. Second one here, right, stepping through. Got a hold of him, press on the elbow. So he comes in, one, two, you can throw here. We're gonna do the Arimi Nagi. So let's see, one, two, I guess it would be three. Right, one more time. Hey. So, one, two, three. Hey. Oh. You sunk your pin there too. Kind of slipped out. Or, uh, you're even out so you can go. One, two, three. So, um, you know, that's just our take on it. You know, uh, you guys don't like it, fine, sure, okay. Um, you know, we had a request to get a whack. You guys like it, let us know. Um, like I said, like, share, subscribe, comment, hit that subscribe button at the end of the video, click on Lenny's. Uh, a lot of stuff coming down the way. And uh, check out Facebook, Aikido Virginia Beach, and we'll catch you guys later.